I am here. I'll highlight the server with the AR reconstruction software. It's out of reach, so you'll need to use a heavy cargo drone to steal it. I've loaded the server into your vehicle. You can go now. Careful on the road. We don't want to damage the server. Cheers. Everything is going full throttle ever since we joined up, don't it? In progress. This will do. Remain in the area until I've downloaded enough data to the server. Download complete. I need a wider sample of data, so I'm pushing you the coordinates to a new location. This is brilliant. Look at this! It's compiling data from the surveillance infrastructure. Nearby CTOS drones, civilian optics, CCTV, and then it assembles those scraps into what happened in this location 24 hours ago. Fantastic! Data reconstruction in progress. All right, scraping data from optics, CTOS cameras, microphones, laptops. Say, do you reckon SRS uses this to watch people shag? Fucking hell, do they use it for anything but watching people shag? Bagley, I think those are for us. Well, shit, can you do anything to lose your new friends? Maybe invite them to a pottery night or overshare something personal. Whatever you do, just get to the last location in one piece. Oh, fuck me. All right. Transfer complete. I'm missing one last data set. Pushing you the coordinates to the location now. Could use a little help, Ugly. It's still on to me. Don't let the drones destroy the server before I'm done. Get out of the lorry and take care of them. Shoot them, throw rocks at them, destroy them psychologically with cyberbullying. Just keep them busy until the transfer's complete. Over. Control, I'm ready to... 
target. server forever. We should probably wipe our prints off it anyway. Go on. I'll overload the CPUs to cause a power spike and destroy the battery unit. The electromagnetic pulse should destroy both the server and the drones. So, you know, run! wasn't it? We pulled off a heist, made life a bit harder for the tyrants of the world, and most importantly, I got a new toy to play with. Now, run along back to the safe house. Sabine wants you and your new teammates for a briefing. Well done, team. It's good to see the safe house filling up again. The only way we're going to keep London from falling into total oppression is by rebuilding the resistance. We need to recruit, train, build back our arsenal. The people are itching to rise up and take their city back. We just need to show them that Dead Sec are fighting along with them. Absolutely. And we'll help take down the people who are exploiting this tragedy. Let's not forget Albion. There's a literal army occupying the city. I won't stand for that. Not to mention those Clan Kelly pricks are escalating. The gangsters are running rampant. Fair, but remember that this zero-day hacker group is still out there. They took out DedSec once, and it's a good bet they'll try again. I believe they were responsible for the bombings and framed DedSec. With your help, I plan to get to the bottom of this mystery. I'd say that's a full docket. Enough talk. Let's unfuck London. found a lead that may help us unravel more about Zero Day and the bombings we ate shit for. I've picked up an encrypted signal from the Tone Conference site that's been broadcasting on a loop since the night of the bombing. Go investigate. You might even get to try out that fancy new AR tech we stole. I mean, creatively shared. Building a resistance group requires operatives with specialized skills. Technical abilities, firearms handling, and physical training are all valuable. Bare knuckle boxing rings are a good place to find people who are good at throwing punches or taking them. By defeating each opponent in an arena, you'll have an opportunity to face its best fighter. Prove your physical superiority, and they may consider joining DedSec. I'm guessing that's some sort of primate society thing. It feels wrong behind here since it was abandoned. Known hundreds of people were hurt and died here. It was to deal with all the security walking around. Place isn't even open to the public, so why are they here? Point taken. Why am I looking for a bagley? Any kind of device or component that could still be emitting the signal, it seems to be coming from within the rubble.
he's looking to automate our jobs, mate. This is no joke. Director Cass? Y you're serious? Who told you that? Friend over in R&D. The shit he's told me about. About background checks and knowing who's going to be useful to Albion, who's going to be a problem. You that worried about your job? This is a PMC. They already do background checks on all of it. What the fuck? This is it. The signal is coming from this spider-bot fragment. No indication yet who it belongs to. Torn up, eh? What is that doing here, Buckley? Difficult to say, but with an AR reconstruction, we may be able to see what happened to it and if it relates to the attack. Access data relays in the vicinity, and I can compile enough data to build the AR reconstruction. Two more data relays to go. Over there. Look out. data relay and I'll have it.
That should do it. Now, I'll just take the audio from this stream and the video from these 36 and... Got it. Go back to where you found that spider-bot and I'll show you the AR reconstruction from the night of the explosion. Copy. You brought the payload? Fuck, think we'd go back to you? Don't trust the Kelly dog. Kelly? Clan Kelly? Why would gangsters blow up our tech conference? Seems to me like they supplied the explosives. They were making a delivery. But who were they meeting? She didn't seem like one of their crew. You think she could be working with Zero there? Well, don't just stand there. Keep looking. Are you able to determine who is controlling the spider bot? I've now fully decrypted the signal the spider bot is broadcasting. And while I cannot identify a specific user, it is a call code used by the Metropolitan Police Service. Fuck me sideways. The cops were watching this go down. The reconstruction continues behind that rubble. Excellent. I trust you have some sort of quantum tunnel for me for John True Bagley. Quantum tunnel technology is at least 10 years away, but spider bots and drones are here today. You could try one of those if you don't feel like waiting. Good idea. those human eyeballs of yours at the van's cargo. Copy. RDX Nitrogen and the exact same detonator system like... like the bombs that were planted at Parliament. That's Zero Day's signature. There, hurry. We've got all the delivery. So you were hired to fight all the targets? Shut it. We're all on need to know. So, Zero Day was effectively using subcontractors to pull off their bombings. That's certainly one way to pull off a massive coordinated attack while remaining anonymous. Zero Day needed manpower and resources, but they needed them at an arm's length. And it doesn't take the world's greatest AI detective to see that both Clan Kelly and Albion benefited in the aftermath. Unfortunately, this is the most we can get out of the AR reconstruction. But if we could find the mystery officer who was spying through the spider bot, maybe they could tell us more.
tracing the Spinobot serial number it was assigned to New Scotland Yard three years ago. Perhaps more information about its user or its assignment will be available at the station. It's hard to believe the police would have been tracking the real bombers and not saying anything about it to the public. The only way to know for sure is to investigate New Scotland Yard. Lord have mercy. Looks like Albion's running the station. And the entire police service. But don't worry, if you're not pleased with your privatized goon squad, just take your business across the street. I never would have thought I would have longed for normal conflicts between police and citizens. Not to worry. The only difference now is the uniform, assault weapons, and the fact they're motivated by profit over public service. Now, any record or information on the Spider-Bot will be further in. Buckley, is that the same spider butt? According to the serial numbers, this matches the piece of spider bot from the Tone bombing site. Any chance he can ID the last user? Navigate the spider bot from out of that room. I'll need a direct connection in order to learn more from our bisected friend. I'm onto it. There we go. I think you just made a new friend. If Albion wanted to lock them up, they must be dangerous. And dangerous we can use. Yes. Surrender now! <gasps>
That opening right there looks like a good exit point. Right, get comfy. This spider bot might be broken and missing some of its legs, but it can still jump and fit through vents. That's a good way to get through the station undetected. That's a part of the remote detonator system from Parliament. If the Met, or Albion rather, actually analyzed it, they would see it wasn't dead sex handiwork at all. That's Dalton's mask. It must have been recovered from Parliament. It might be the only thing left of him now. You'll have to jump your way across to get to the next bent opening. Make your way through this last bent path. Got it. Scanning Spybot and accessing its internal drives. While I'm analyzing this data, you should make yourself scarce. Unless you'd like to explain to your new, heavily armed, privatized police force why you've broken into the station. All right. The 
Spiderbot fragment you found has a satellite-based GPS module that regularly pushed its location to a specific ground station. Secret location? That's interesting. We should go and find out where we can. Pushing you the ground station's coordinates. Thank you.